The new sanctuary and multipurpose facility of the Antioch Baptist Church was officially blessed and commissioned at two dedication services on Sunday, May 26th, at its new location in Lime Kiln. One service was held Sunday morning and a second service Sunday afternoon at 3 p.m. Senior pastor of the Antioch Baptist Church, Lincoln Connor, spoke to SK Newsline Sunday evening about the occasion. We had the dedication service uh, at 9.30 on May the 26th and at 3.30 we had an additional service. Now these activities, uh, the way that they were done, were outlined that way so that we would be able to accommodate uh, the number of persons we knew were going to attend because this project has spanned not only our congregation but we would say uh, the entire federation, the goodwill and the input we've had from so many individuals and additionally we've had lots of individuals returning from the diaspora some who are actually coming in on Sunday um, and so we had to plan these activities so that everyone would be able to be a part of it but we actually believe that the main service we would have as many as 2,000 people and so for that reason we decided to have two services to give individuals the opportunity to be a part of the celebration. Pastor Connor also noted that while the contributions of members played in a role in funding the construction, it was the combined goodwill of friends of the ministry that helped the process of the construction of the building. It is not merely the congregation, it's the goodwill that this church has built up over 56 years. That's a long time. And not only is that a long time, but that's a lot of goodwill. And so people saw this as an opportunity for them to give back to something that is indigenous and very authentic because people look at Antioch Baptist Church as their church. Even if they do not attend Antioch Baptist Church, lots of people like the church because they like the philosophy, they like the principles and that kind of stuff. So they didn't find it difficult to actually contribute to the process. So we engaged in the process because one, we believed, we had a heart for the process, we believed that God was totally in it. And then we also mobilized our people to be part of it. But those persons in our congregation made that decision even before the leadership made the decision that they wanted a new, congregate, a new uh, facility. And with that in mind, they were willing to do the work that was necessary to make it happen. Meanwhile, Pastor Connor said that the old Antioch Baptist Church building in the village will still play a role in the mission of the church. We have an expansive agenda we have a number of things that we want to do at that facility. And so in the process of time, we are going to uh, roll those out. I can't say that we're going to do one, two, three, four, because we have a number of things that we would like to do, and the church is going to discuss those and decide which ones would be more appropriate at first. What we do know, however, is that we believe that the Lord wanted us to actually keep that building based on how this project turned out and because of all the history that is in wrapped up in that building so many people can talk about having lost their wedding bands and all that kind of stuff um, pouring dirt and breaking bricks for the foundation of that church and so folks still do not want to see the church give up that building not even for another church in their mind the church must find a way to utilize it in terms of ministry and our pastor made prophetic declarations and I remember growing up, he would say things like, this building would never become a warehouse, would never become a grocery store. So there were some things that uh, are non-negotiables when it comes to the use of that building. But uh, we have a big vision for ministry. The Antioch Baptist Church is one of the oldest churches in St. Kitts and Nevis and was founded by the legendary Dr. William Connor. The church is known for its missionary work within the country in spreading the gospel of Christ and plays an important role within the Christian community and social development in its surrounding community and the nation on a whole. Pastor Connor promised that the church will continue to play that role in its new building. Andre Huey, SKN Newsline.